had before. Huh. Uh, but you see right here, there's a like a curve. But I, I split it to do an edge loop, but that was bad. Um, because I can't add any geometry right there without screwing it up. So delete that one. Now this one, what I did was I just got a cube and I got this edge right here, pretend this is a cube, and then this is the other side of the cube. I extruded it, I, no, I didn't extrude it, I pulled one in all the way to here, and so you have a cube like that, and then I added the edge loops right here, and moved that, those bottom ones around, added them over here, moved those around, and then I had something like that, so then I extruded this part down, and added the loops right here. So this has a better geometry because I can add straight down right here. And that's all I need. I can add a loop cut and that goes for this one. And add another loop cut and that'll go right there. And then right here, uh, well, it already makes a curve. So I should be able to do it like that, but it's not going to work that way. Still, one, two, three. I could if I made that a triangle, but I'm just gonna leave it all quads for now because this is good enough and does what I want it to. Alright. Now, as for, I added some more detail on this back thing. As you can see, I made that a separate piece. Uh, I, I wanted to make that 3D so it looked pretty cool. Let's see what I did. Continue on the detail of the back part. Go here, type in edit mode. Control R. Vertices mode. I'm just following the edges where it curves in. I just want to smooth these out some. I'm not going to add that, it's not, you're not going to see it. Alright, 
No, you just round it off. I just thought of something, but it's too late now. as far as I'm going to go to that uh, and that's going to look a lot better if I add it smooth see looking nice and good but uh, it's going to be flat right now it lets me see more edges ah, the command that's accident Pretty sweet. I'm not even gonna lie.
Now you can see that it's coming together. Probably gonna redo this top piece though. Um, oh yeah, clear to do that. And then after I do this, probably end this tutorial. Hey, must be the control. Oops. That looks pretty cool. This part though. There you go. And now we got this part to do. Uh, it looks like that part is actually like smaller than my actual gun. Move that down. Alright, I guess I can start on the barrel now. Well, I'm gonna end this tutorial, then I'll start on the barrel.